I've got the joy, 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 joy down in my heart. Where? Down in my heart. Where? Down in my heart. I've got the joy, 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 joy down in my heart. Where? Down in my heart to stay. Stay. Yes, God's joy will stay in our heart. It's not like a fleeting happiness. This is Advent week, and what are we focusing on? Joy. <laughs> so let's enjoy this particular segment of Advent. So I want to share my favorite scripture with you about joy. Check this out. Dun, da, da, da. It's on a purse. Oh, it has to be a purse, yes. huh? The joy of the Lord is your strength, Nehemiah 8.10. So what's great about this scripture is that at this time in the Bible, the Israelites had been in exile and they just returned back to Jerusalem and they were to go and build the wall around the temple. The temple was being rebuilt. And then they were in the midst of the presence of God and the law was being read to them. And when they heard it, their reaction was weeping. They were full of repentance. And God told them this scripture. He said, the joy of the Lord is your strength. It's time to rejoice, folks. I am your yeah. God. I love you. I'm welcoming you with compassion and grace. And that's who our God is. We can always rejoice in the Lord because he has given us the best gift in the world. And that's Jesus Christ. He's forgiven us for all of our sins, past, present, and future. Amen to that. So rejoice in the Lord always. And scripture tells us, say it again, rejoice, rejoice in, in the, the Lord. Lord. So what I want us to remember and reflect on this week in Advent comes from Luke 2. Luke 2 verses 10 through 12. But the angel said to them, do not be afraid for behold, I bring you good news of great joy that will be for all the people. Today, in the city of David, a savior has been born to you. He is Christ the Lord. And this will be a sign to you. You will find a baby wrapped in swaddling cloths and lying in a manger. And so this is what joy is all about. Christmas joy in our savior and his love for us. Amen to that Amen. too. You know what I picked up on that scripture oh, when you were reading it? was the uh, phrase, do not be afraid. I actually recently have learned that that is repeated in the Bible a little over 300 times, depending on which translation you are reading. So if it's said that many times, I guess that's probably... Almost one for every day. <laughs> almost, that's right. So do not be afraid. But the other side to the scripture that was read today was also having joy. And just like our song started out, joy in my heart and and i guess sometimes you know like what we're going through now is kind of hard yeah. but also it's available to us that our joy in the lord is available um he's always accessible so that's one of the yes. really really cool things about advent christmas waiting for the lord and also waiting for his return so, so you can also check us out on Sundays at 11 a.m. We are still meeting out in the courtyard in Pacific Palisades safely. We have sanitation stations. You got to wear your mask. You sign in and join us for a little worship and a word and some fellowship. It's really, really cool. Amen. We're going to celebrate the presence of the Lord together and be joyful. Amen. Amen. Rejoice in the Lord always. Rejoice in the Lord always. I've got the joy, 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 joy down in my heart. Where? Down in my heart. Where? Down in my heart. I've got the joy, 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 joy down in my heart. Where? Down in my heart to stay.